is a delicate balance to maintain the right environment and protection for sea turtles during their nesting season on our beaches here in Central Florida. And even with that, sometimes they need to be rescued. West 2 Scott Heidler spoke with a certified rescuer on a recent save. The beaches of Brevard are the top spot for sea turtle nesting in all of Florida. That's why some of the beaches are protected and monitored. Nesting season is underway and off to a strong start, nearly 15,000 nests already. The Sea Turtle Prevention Society is on the front lines, making sure it's safe for the turtles coming ashore to lay eggs. And just last week, Cindy Stinson came to the rescue of one sea turtle mother. She's certified by FWC for sea turtle rescues. So I got a call at 6.30 in the morning of a turtle stranded underneath the walkway. She lives close to the beach and rushed over. She was right under that, under there, where the writing is. And all I saw were her hind flippers and her hind end. And she was completely buried and wedged under there. It's a delicate situation when turtles get stuck. Only those trained specifically to help them should come to the rescue. That's because they're very easy to injure and an injured sea turtle survival is very low. And then I was able to turn her so she would be able to see the ocean and kind of stop panicking as bad um, and then turn her to where she could crawl out on her own because the goal would be for her to crawl out on her own. They think that the mother was able to lay her eggs before she was freed and returned to the ocean. Last season, nearly 50,000 nests here in Bavard. With that many, if you're on the beach. Give the turtle space, especially if you see one coming up just to nest. Um, you want to get out of her vision, out of her eye line of sight. You don't want to scare her. They are very, um, can be very timid walking out of the ocean. You know, they're afraid of predators or looking where to lay their nest. So you want to back up. The same goes when she returns to the ocean after laying her eggs. Keep your distance. And the outcome of this rescue? You know, I, I checked her carapace real quick to make sure I didn't see any um, injuries, you know, from being stuck under there. And she made her way back quickly. So that's a good sign that she's fine, you know. So um, it, it's always great to see them go back home. In Melbourne Beach, Scott Heidler, West 2 News. For more information on how to help with the conservation.